Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Uh oh, hold on. I've got the wrong scene over there. There we go. And this is Let's Make a Game. Um, so I've been working on a lot of different things, and what I've been currently working on is the like the rotation scripts um, to try and get the rotation of objects correct whenever I um, rotate things. But tonight, I kind of wanted to play. I had created this and just saw it kind of sitting there, and it was all gray and stuff. And I'm like, that's kind of cool that the smoke particles will do that and stuff. And then I thought, you know, it kind of looks like a, a ball of ice. And then I thought, wait a second, I can make that into a ball of ice. And then I can make that ball of ice actually do something because I, I now have the ability to grab stuff and pick it up. So, what I'm going to do tonight is um, just a thought. Oh gosh. <laughs> It's just a thought or an idea. What I'd like to be able to do... Oh, do I have to wait for these every single time? Maybe the intro wasn't such a good idea. Maybe, maybe I'm going to switch that. Maybe. Anyhow, come over here. Wow, that is just... Wow. It's not that loud, right? Okay. Maybe I need to adjust that. Um, my idea was to come over here and to um, grab the ball, and if you pick up the ball and then you throw it into the ocean, like that, if it hits the ocean, it will freeze it for said amount of time. And I'll make it for like a little bit. Anyhow, that was my idea, my thought behind it, and I thought it to be a wonderful idea. So, um, why not? Uh, I'm gonna have fun with it. In fact, that's what I'm going to do tonight. Um, I also created uh, these little ice particles, which on the ball, Make no sense. It's like, what in the world is that craziness, right? <clears throat> Don't worry about that. I'll show you what I'm going to do with that here in a second. Um, where is, is it server side scripts, intro, and disabled for now. So, back over to here. Um, I'm going to create a new script. Uh, do, 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 script depo. We're just going to call this the ice ball script. Ball script. And I would probably do this a different way if I were going to have multiple ones, but this is what I'm going to do to start out. Uh, let's zoom in here. Let's do local uh, start pose. Start pose equals, oh, actually, um, let's do local, local this equals script.parent, because we're gonna need to use this a lot. Uh, local start pose equals this dot position. Uh, I guess I could just say C frame, right? C frame. There we go. So um, do, 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 do. let's see. Local function uh, freeze, and then part. I guess. No, uh, we just th want the. Yeah, let's do part. Uh, lowercase part. Uh, so first thing we want to do is if part dot name equals water, then. So that's that's what we're going to do. And then next I'm going to do um, da, 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 this dot touched colon connect freeze. So that, that way it will detect whenever a touch is started. If the name of that thing that it touched is not water, then it doesn't care and it goes, goes on about its business. So if the thing that we touch is water, then uh, water equals part. Uh, we gotta make that local. And then we're going to say uh, water.material. Thank you, Dragon VN, for the subscribe. Uh, material equals enumeration dot materials dot ice uh, water dot can can collide equals true uh, what else oh this dot ice part uh, clone and we're gonna say um, I'm just going to call it local sparkles equals this dot ice part dot clone uh, sparkles dot parent equals water and then sparkles dot what, what is it called disabled um, down here at the bottom it's a it's a behavior dot enabled 
dot enabled equals true. So <clears throat> with this, I'm going to drop the ball in. It's going to touch the water. It's going to freeze the water. And then we should be able to move around on top of the water, maybe, um, after that. So um, let's see. And let's do a wait for 90 seconds. That's a that's a good minute and a half. And then we are going to water dot material. Oh, uh, I guess I should do the originals, right? Okay, so uh, actually no, I'm not. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to say water dot material equals enumeration dot material dot plastic. What is it? Smooth plastic water dot can collide equals false water dot sparkles destroy that way it gets rid of the uh, particles and then this dot c frame equals um, start pose so the, the whole process is take the ball, drop it in, it turns the water into ice, and then the ice um, will stay frozen for 90 seconds. Uh, oh, and if the part name is water, then this dot uh, anchored equals true. That way we freeze in place. This dot uh, anchored equals false. So everything that we do at the top, we have to do down here at the bottom. Oh, and I did want to make a sound. So let's go over to the audio library. Let's look for Roblox. And we're looking for freeze. By the way, I don't know why the uh, developer sounds are not working. No. 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 No just need a sound effect and I think these are all going to be songs yeah these are all songs I don't want a song I want a sound effect okay so here's what I'm going to do um, we're gonna pause the actual sound and I'm going to come in here to uh, YouTube, and let's go to ice freezing sound. So here we go. No, that's that's like a. Da, 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 da. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Uh, 10 hours of ice cracking. Oh, that's gentle freezing rain. Uh, race sleet in a car. That's not what I want. I, I want like a ice crackling sound effect. <clears throat> there we go. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. Mm -mm, mm -mm. No, 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 no. I just want the sound. There we go. That's a that's a good sound, but that's like 10 hours of it. Okay, okay. So I'm going to bust out my audacity. Here we go. Uh, okay, yes. Um, let's go this. Uh, yeah, that looks good. Uh, pull this off to the right. By the way, this is Audacity. It's a great little program for sound audio files. I'm going to hit record. Uh, test, test, test. Uh-oh. Got the wrong input. Hold on. Um, stop. And close that one. Direct sound. There we go. Still not working. Hold on. Stop. Uh, microphone. Stereo mono. It's 
speakers, NVIDIA high definition, primary sound driver. Is it? Uh, test, test, test. It's got to be that one. Right, close that. Play. No. Stop. Uh, nope. Still wrong. Uh, Microsoft Sound Mapper. No, I, it's got to be the those. And microphone. Oh, speakers. There we go. Okay. I don't like the sound of the wind in the background, though. So let's kill this and That's good. Okay, so. All right, let's zoom in here. Want to cut off, whoop, oh, come here, right there. Cut this off, delete. Now I'm gonna go towards the end. I'm gonna cut off the end right here. Delete. And can we do a fade out? Is there, is there a fade out effects? Fade out. There we go. So the whole sound should sound like this. Oh, hold on. Zoom in a little bit. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it works. Works. Uh, file, we're going to do export as an WAV file. No, uh, OGG. <clears throat> uh, okay, those were the sound files. Let's just slap it on the desktop here. And we're going to call it Ice Freeze. There we go. Yeah, artist. Uh, artist name is not me. The uh, natural sounds, I guess. <laughs> Shout out to natural sounds. Go subscribe to them. And thank you for uh, let me use that. And let's minimize, minimize, minimize. How do I import sound? I think I have to do uh, those. Those are, nope. Those are not sound files. Um, do, 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 do. Hold on. Oh, okay. Go over to developer, and I have to go to my creations. My creations. Is it real? <clears throat> Sorry, audio. And choose. And where, where did we go? We were on the desktop. Uh, desktop. Freezing sound. Ice freezing. Oh, OG. Estimate the price, please. Uh, 20 Robux. I'll pay that. Ice freezing sound is now added. Uh, you can use this yourself, by the way. Copy. And I'll come back over here, uh, and let's just say um, ice uh, local ice sound. I guess I should put all my locals up here at the top, right? I don't know if that's proper or not. I usually just leave it where it's at. Give it a little bit of white space, kind of space everything out here. Uh, that's not anchored equal true. Uh, wait for the 90s. Wait for the 90s to happen. <laughs> uh, and then sparkles. Okay, cool. So, uh, let's do local ice sound equals sound sound no, instance dot new sound. And then we can say ice sound dot sound ID equals R B X no R B L X asset colon slash slash number. Hold on, I gotta copy that number again. What does it look like? Let's do this. The way I always do this is I hit this, hit a plus, I put in sound. Oh, I can hit my uh, play again. 
and then I come down here to my ice ID I paste it in and then I move off of it and what this does it gives you, you the RBX asset ID number like that and this is what you actually have to script in there I can never remember the first part RBX asset ID colon slash slash I should be able to remember that but I don't also it needs to have double quotes I mean single quotes would work but you can't mix them not when you're defining a string um, ice dot I sound dot parent equals this and then ice sound dot plane equals true I sound uh, colon for calling the function play and then uh, we have to destroy the I sound after the reset so this dot uh, I guess I didn't name it did I I mean our variables got a name so let's do um, ice sound dot name equals ice sound colon like that and then this dot ice sound colon destroy that way we can get that out of there as well so we create it up here we play the sound and then we destroy it down here so hopefully I think that's everything maybe hold on I gotta I gotta pause my sound so I can hear it do, 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 do. okay here it goes Dude, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, but it's only going to last for 90 seconds. Oh, no. <laughs> Froze the ice with the ice sphere, ice uh, the ice ball, and it's like stuck in the water. Oh, that is so cool looking. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. We're, we're going to have to implement that somehow. That is so cool. That is too cool. Now, I wonder how many of those. So, so I should be able to do just a singular script. And then any ice ball that's resident to the world, you uh, require. Actually, this would be a great time to require uh, a script so if self dot touched connect do a modular script and then no because you'd still have to have a regular script inside the ball that says or or you could go through the entire object world or as the it's resed into the world no we'll leave it as a script for now uh oh Can colid, can colid. We have we have an error in our script because I had a misspelling. Can colid, can collide. Let's just do it for uh, ten seconds for right now, just so we can test it again. Oh, do -do -do -do. My creation is real. So here we go. Oh, oh, come here, come here, you. Come here. Now I'm just gonna drop it this time. <laughs> 10 seconds. Oh, what? Oh, 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 oh. Sorry. Um, same thing that we did with the, the ice sound. Sparkles.name equals sparkles. There we go. Because I didn't know how to destroy. Is there anything else I was destroying? It was just the, the ice sound, right? And we should be able to turn this up so we can hear it a little bit better. better. <laughs> There we go. And while I'm in here, I'm going to go ahead and turn this sound down some. Maximum distance is 10,000 meter size. Where's the volume? Oh, it's it. All right. We're going 0.25, boys. 0.25. All right. So there's the ice ball with its awesome stuff. Throw. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, man. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Something has horribly gone wrong. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Why is it doing that? Oh, is it the velocity? It is. Oh no. So we reset the the C frame and we anchored it, but the the Wait, no, that doesn't make any sense. Hold on, let's see if we can catch it on this one. Get ready. Get ready. Here it comes. Catch. Did I get it? I kind of caught it. It's got the, the ball on there, so... Yeah, there it goes. So because it had a velocity... Do we need to stop the velocity for some reason? doesn't make a whole lot of sense because I don't think a part has velocity on it does it velocity okay how fast the uh, part is traveling in studs per second this property is not recommended for to be modified directly okay then we are not going to modify it directly technically so um, before because here's material, can collide is false, anchored is false. I'm going to go this dot velocity equals vector three dot new, because it takes a vector, zero, zero, zero. So we don't want to have any velocity when that thing comes back up to the top. I think. I think. I believe so. Chop it with our axe. Oh, uh, no, we can't. Actually, if you have an axe in your hand, you can't click. So, all right, 10 seconds. It should reappear right back up here with no velocity. There, it worked. So now let's try throwing it. Whoa, throw it. Oh no, it went through the water. It didn't detect the hit. No. <laughs> Failure. Don't throw the ball into the water. It doesn't doesn't work. <laughs> All right. Um, play. There's other stuff that we could do. Like, um, is the water already frozen? If so, uh, the no collide doesn't work. All right. For this, I need velocity. So I I can't even see underneath it right now. I love the sparkles, by the way. That's awesome. Why are you still rolling? Uh, I need to change its friction value, don't I? You still rolled just a little bit, didn't you? You silly goose. All right, let's go ahead and stop. Um, I should probably hide this so you have to find it somewhere. Right? Hmm. Now, how do I create a cone? Actually, I'm not going to create a cone. I'm going to do this. All right, control to duplicate so we have two of them go over to the module script I'm going to create a sphere or not a sphere uh, I'm gonna create a box come here just grab just can I just grab you please just just grab there we go uh, you Why 
Where is it? Oh, because I'm not moving by studs. Okay. Um, Z axis. Where is position? Z axis. I want you to be uh, 86. And you, Z axis, will be 86. There we go. And you're about in the middle. So I'm going to scale this down. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. That looks good. And we're going to do uh, 12. No, point two two. Scale that down right about there. Now this, we don't actually need anything inside because it's going to become part of something else. Um, let's see. Uh, let's do move, control, duplicate. Pull you up here. And I want to do control, duplicate, one. Control, duplicate, two, three, four. So that should be four parts, right? Uh, negate and rotate. We want to rotate by 45 degrees, like that. And we should be able to move. Uh, control L so it's globally, not locally. One, one, two, three, like that. You are going to be, uh, hold on, then that one, negate, rotate, Mm, that way and move one two three just like that now this one actually here I can uh, I can destroy that part and I can destroy that part and that part Wow so I'm gonna take you two come here duplicate you rotate you around here 90 degrees I'm gonna take you two duplicate and we're gonna rotate 45 degrees so we should okay we're gonna to need to move those out some so let's do move Control L, and we want this one. Hold on, come here. Come here, you. Not that one. That one. Move you down just a little bit. There you go. Same thing with this one. Come down just a little bit. This corner. Come here. Come here. Oh, I can't get it. No, not you that one you come down you might be thinking what are you doing code seriously what's what is this it's going to be a base or a stand for it to sit on so that looks good uh can we do a select uh-oh uh-oh All of these parts, and where's the where's the other part? Okay, so it's not in land. Which one was it? It was next to that ice ball, right? That ice ball is going to be negative. Hold on. That ice ball is not negative. Why are you not? Negative. Is it a negative part? Hold on. Move you up. It is negative, but why is it a different color? Huh. Alright. Control Z, Z, Z. There we go. Okay. And what part are you? Oh, come on. There we go. That one right there. 
Uh, so this part and all of these parts we are going to combine together. So union. Oh, nice. Wait, where's the ball? Is the sphere in there? Um, let's see, we should be able to change to a blue color and material change to ice. Oh, that looks really good. That looks really good. Okay. Hmm. So now to find a spot to place this, let's go ahead and uh, move you right there. Let's take you and place you right in the middle. So, um, move by point 0.2. Can I go down just a little bit more? Nope. So, <clears throat> hopefully that will work. Oh wait, I forgot to anchor, anchor the part. That's okay. Uh, no, it's not okay. Okay, so stop, stop, stop. <clears throat> I don't like that, that it's still gray. Can, can we change the color? Can we change this to like a green or blue? Do I have to separate? Then do the color blue and then union? Yeah, there we go. It's not the right color though. And then material is going to be ice. Way it's all sparkly. Uh, and I bet, okay, so uh, this needs to be anchored. Let's do an anchor real quick. Anchored. Good. So uh, I, I know it's been 30 minutes of j just me playing around, but I mean, that's, that's what I love about Roblox and about code. Like, it just. Oh, that is so cool. Because it just, it fits perfectly, nicely, neatly, right back into place. And then you can take it over here, drop it in, freezes the ice. And then 10 seconds later, it should reappear in its original position. Yes. So let's hit stop real quick, and we're gonna go back over to the iceball script. We're going to increase this to what do you say? What's a what's a good time? Three minutes? Okay, Google. What is three minutes times sixty? The answer is three hours. That's not, that's not what I want. Okay, Google. How many seconds are in three minutes? Three minutes is equal to one hundred eighty seconds. 180 seconds. I should have known that. 60, 60, 60. That's, that's what it is. Okay. So now that we have uh, three minutes to play around, I'm going to go over. Oh gosh, I don't want to walk all the way over there. Let's, uh, but I'm going to make you guys walk all the way over there. Unless you're the first person in and then you can get a car. That'd be fun for Friday for the Friday live stream. Ice cars. All right, so uh, F5, we're going to play. All right, and take the ball. Take, oh, oh, come here, come here, ball. Drop the ball into the water. There we go. And now. Ooh, ooh, oh no. Oh no, I'm upside down. That won't work at all. Oh, come on. Oh no. Oh no. No. I'm stuck again. It's 
stuck in the middle with you. Oh, I'm stuck in the middle with you. Maybe that was a really bad idea to do. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and reset. Reset character. Yes, I'm sure. Oh, goodness. Mm, so, I'm going to need to weigh... Uh, you know, I never made a ramp down into the water. So, actually, if we drive off the end of the pier, that should be okay. But we're going to have to get another one. Hello, big me. That's my big face. All right. Here we go. Let's jump on this thing. Even though it's probably been three minutes now. Going backwards, going backwards, going backwards, go! Shaboom! Yeah! Oh gosh, there's like zero traction. <laughs> it's because the material is force field. <laughs> this is amazing! What? Yay! Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm spinning in circles, I'm spinning in circles. <laughs> oh no, is that the end of the ocean? It's the end of the ocean right there. Alright, or the end of the ice. No! I fell in the water, help me! Okay, that's pretty, that's pretty cool. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Let's Make a Game with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, as I fool around and played a little bit with some awesomeness and just basically general scripting. Um, I know these aren't tutorials, but I hope you're having fun with them because I know I am. And quite frankly, that was an awesome thing to build. Uh, in fact, I think I'm going to make that into a model and then, yeah, it's, it will see where it goes, but... Till next time, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end, but it's really up to you. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you soon. <gasps> Outro.